farm is located in north central Montana. We farm just outside of Shelby, Montana. A small town. I grew up my whole life here, went to high school here, and it's a, it's a nice little town. A lot of really good people here. So it all began back in 2011. We started throwing up some videos on YouTube thinking it'd be kind of fun to show some of the farm operations, some of the fun things we do on the farm. Little did I know that there would be a lot more people that would like it than I thought. So as we started to put more videos up, things started happening, whether it was a build that we were doing in the shop, some of these classic tractors that we have, the big bud tractors that became world famous. And all these little bits and pieces came together and they just put a spotlight on us. Nick was always on his phone and uh, we had work to do and then he wanted to stop and get the camera out to record this stuff. And uh, so it was challenging for me because I'm kind of like, I want to just work and just get things done. And so I bite my teeth and then afterwards you get to see some of the content you're like, it's actually kind of neat. Yeah, it's been quite an adventure for for me, uh, especially with the boys and the, really the whole family. What has gone on with this uh, new media that has uh, come on to play in the you know in the last really ten years? By just continuing to make videos of all kinds of different aspects of farming, eventually evolving into the vlogging style, which now we're called farm tubers. It's just become a way of our life now, literally having a camera in our face and just about everything we do. And uh, I never saw it coming. the channel so a lot of people think well it's 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 about Nick Welker well it's really not it's actually become about Welker Farms and that involves my brother and my dad extensively it's been a fun journey uh, it has been stressful but it's it's something that if you ever looked back and said you, you never took the opportunity you'd be kicking yourself we have been able to give them the opportunity especially with case IH coming in and, and uh, seeing that potential of the social media that we can share and also educate at the same time what we're doing. Everything we do and say is a reflection of our faith. 